everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Inheritance. So we did jump systems at the end of the last episode. Uh, we're in Quarrel now, all our mechs are back, everything looks to be good if we go to Mech Bay real quick. You know, I always have to double check because, you know, <laughs> there's often times I'll put a mech together and it'll just, it'll just be like, you have the wrong ammo. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so uh, yeah, everything looks to be fine, which is good. Uh, so we jump to Quarrel, we're going to have a quick look at navigation here, I'll show you where we are. Um, and I jumped into a system that there was about to be a um, a battle. It said like 28 days or something. But I guess when you get there, the the mission starts. If if you don't accept it, um, it goes away. But if you if you accept it when you get there, it just kind of starts. So now that we're there, the Free Rasselhag forces are actually attacking the uh, they're in Commonwealth forces. So that's what we're going to be doing. Um, there's I chose this one one because it's a three skull planet. So I'm hoping we get some good difficulty fights. And the second one was, is it should go pretty quick because Rasselhag completely outnumbers them. And the last time the the enemy had roughly this amount of forces, we only pulled off like two missions and it was over and we got our stuff. So I'm hoping that's what happens. Now, that being said, um, we're sitting on the planet with no money. So we need cash before the end of the uh, financial report. Now we do have some stuff we could sell, so I'm not like worried about the financial report. We got our first contract here in one day, so let's go ahead and advance the timeline. Yeah, and we're gonna take this mission. Let's do it. Um, we're gonna go 312. The three salvage really isn't worth the 400,000 we'll be losing. We'll, we'll take the million and pay out. It's fine for me. Just depends on what we're up against. Now, I don't know. This is a three and a half skull mission again, so that's interesting. So the last planet that we were at, um, it was a three and a half skull. And this one's a three and a half skull. Now I wanted to bring the Jenner, but I don't know. Uh, three and a half skulls, I think we'll leave it for now. It's as of yet untested, so... And I don't know who I would pull out at the moment. I mean, I guess the best trade-off would be uh, the Wolverine or the Halop. Halopolis, but I'm hesitant to pull either of those two out. I mean, I guess I could pull the Cephalus, but it's doing so well. Uh, the Nidhogg, I think we'll leave in. Right? With the Gauss Rifle hanging back. Good chunky armor. So I think we'll do that. And, I mean, we're at two and a half skulls here, so I think we should be okay. Um, yeah, I think we're fine. Command interface initiated. All right, Desert World, this should be okay. Hopefully, it works in our favor. Move forward, identify the enemy lands, and light them up. It's uh, one of the things we're ex actually actually exceptionally good at: lighting stuff up. Now, uh, okay, they're going to get reinforcements. It looks like probably from over there. So they're probably going to have two lances. Man, I haven't played in this map in a long time. Uh, this was always the tough one where it's like you either come down through here and get funneled into where the enemy are, or um, you kind of play it up on the hill or go around this way to take on the ads first. But these guys on this side are relatively spread out in comparison to these guys down here. So I think I would rather fight them where I've got some cover kill these guys and then turn on the guys down here. So that's what we're going to attempt to do. I think we're going to start in right down here. Uh, I think we're fine there. And then let's get the last guy right there. We should get spawn immunity here. Uh, somebody made a mention too that if you don't drop in the suggested drop zone, you might not get spawn immunity. And it doesn't look like we got any chevrons of evasion here. Heads up. So I wonder if that's the case. Yeah, they do have reinforcements. Oh shit, this could be bad. What do they have? Orion. Axeman. Another Orion. And a trebuchet. So it might just be the four. Nope, it's not. Galleons. So they do have an extra lance. So we're going to have to kill these guys real fast. This is going to be a tough one. Okay. Awaiting orders. No oh, man, we got to... Gotta get the bleeps, the sweeps, and the creeps. 
so let's get on I think I want to get up into here those guys are direct for direct fire are going to take a while but if we can get up into here it'll offer us some protection from the flank now it's a kind of a kill zone between those two um, Orions, but if we can get around the side go. of this rock, I think we we'll, should be okay until we can get up there. It's quite a like quite an open area. This is a rocket launcher guy, so we gotta have to kill him too. Pretty quickly. I think maybe because this is gonna be a bad chance to hit for the first one. Um I'm not gonna bother with the sensors on this guy. Gonna leave that off too. Oh, nice laser hit. Beautiful. A front hit. Good. We should be able to kill that guy quickly then. That's a griffin. Alright. Feel good about that. We're gonna be out of ammo real quick here. The more medium mechs I see on this side, the better. What's with Shadowhawk? Okay. We're burning through our AMS like crazy. Who's going? Is it the Galleon's turn? 15, yeah, he's gonna go. Hopefully he doesn't have enough speed to get close enough to us. This Orion's gotta go too. The MB, what's that one? Yeah, well, here it comes. All right. Is that all of them? Oof. Yeah, we didn't get spawn protection at all. So he's got the silver bullet gas. God, this is going to be a... This will be a battle in the okay. half. Okay, this will give us some, some options. question is, I think this guy's done. He's got a couple of machine guns left and that's probably it. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave the ATGMs off for this. Uh, what's the chances around here? Pretty damn low. Sure. On target. Yes. Slowly restoring my faith in Goss rifles here. So I recorded the first episode of the uh, Duelist series, just so you know. It's going to be a very interesting series. So the guys, that's all I got to say. Um, going to be a very interesting series indeed. So the yeah, first episode with the actual Duelist, and the first episode with the company he's with, have both yeah, been recorded. Um, yeah, it should be fun, I think. It's going to take a bit to get into it, but it should be fun. Uh, if you're going to move up, you better move in the trees. On my way, double time. Okay, um, straight up on this guy, I think. Oof, it's a warm planet. Well, we came out of fire too, right? So, so let's, um... Nah, we gotta apply damage. It's got two Thunderbolts, eh? Thunderbolt 15s, man. That's a lot of damage. All right, one shot in the leg. I mean, the good thing is the more he heats up, the less he can move, which means the less chance he can get in the melee range. Receiving you. Roger. 
Roger that. We gotta take the flames. This thing runs cool anyway, so not that worried. That's a pretty good chance on him. I think I want to go after this guy though. Good damage in the CT. Yeah, we want to get AMS as a backup. Um, ah, damn, really? Let's take the best chance to hit, I think. Well, good AMS, but all our big ones hit, so that's important. Here comes the other guy. Oof. Holy shit. My mech is coming apart around me. I hear ya. Once we drop the first guy, it'll be better, but... Oh, man. Going turbo. Definitely different than the last missions we've been playing. Uh, here we go. You betcha. Orders. I gotta get Sturm over here to block, uh, the guys on the right, because we're gonna take, it's gonna take a while to pull these guys down. So let's hammer these guys. Locked up. Nice. One less target. That's one right massive there. friggin' terror I would have to worry about that's gone now completely. Now. Pushing that guy is a mistake. But then going over here is going to be a mistake too. It won't matter where I go. Moving full speed. We got to close. We got no choice. So, I mean, let's just get on this guy then. Alright, we landed both of them. Okay, he's unstable. I don't know how fast he is. Let's turn 18, of course. They just have better pilots than me. Man, killing these guys is going to be the problem. He's going on I 10, too. My armor. This guy's dead. He's going on 13. 13, 18. 2 on 14, 15. Okay. When are you going? Yep, switch your targets up. It's good job. Helopolis has got the armor. Go ahead and use, shoot on him. Yeah, you better run. Okay, my two light mechs can hunt that guy down. He's like dropping a load in his pants right now. Those AC-20s were like... Commander. Friggin' kryptonite to that guy. Um... Now, let's get, get this guy off of the Nidhog if we can. We'll shoot at him. From nice. So hopefully he'll see the Talos is more of a threat this time. Do a little bit of armor sharing with the Nidhog. Waiting on you, Commander. Um, I think we want to go with Cephalus first. God damn, it's just a bad... Now, we'll go around the flames, but... This might be a bad idea. 
might be a bad idea. Try and get initiative on him next turn. We just dump everything into this guy. Oh, you... Oh, you missed with so many! No short-range missiles remain. Getting a little... What can I do for you? Gotta go through the flames, too. No, we don't have to. We can go here. Not the best chance to hit, but we're taking it. Got it. Okay. When I shoot you, you'll take it and like it. I don't have anybody else to get on that guy with, though. Everybody else has got to... Well, the Nidhogg, maybe. If he's still alive. Minimal damage on that hit. Yes, Commander. Go into full throttle. Hopefully, hopefully this Orion shoots for a killjoy. We'll see here. Get some sensors on him too, might as well. Nice, the large hit. Okay. Not bad, not bad. A little bit of damage. Torso. Nice, nice, nice. Nope. Damn it. You think? Shredded. Not much I can do about that. Just overwhelming firepower. I mean, we could have elected to stay further back, but these guys have got long range weapons. The Thunderbolt 15s would have wrecked us, the Gauss rifles would have wrecked us. It just would have been a matter of time before the medium max got to us, so... Standing by. Acknowledged. Maybe you could help me by replying to this guy. Leave those off for now. Fire the rest. Confirm. Standing by. Affirmative. Get on this guy before he starts shooting at you. Just gonna go with five. Here we go. Let's hopefully hopefully we land one with the eight, uh, ultra twenty here. Yeah, we did. a leg hit. He's going on 13, which means we've still got a chance. Oh, we go before this guy. Okay, good. And they got so many missiles missiles down there. Receiving you. Guy's got ECM. Let's go drop some heat. Come back in fresh next turn. You are. Ready for orders. Your mech is. Your vehicle is probably going to get wiped out too. So it's nice knowing you. On it. We got to pull these heavies down now. Roger that. Okay, here comes.
damage their light or medium guys. I hope she survives enough to get one more round off. I want to get her in on this Orion over here. I just don't think it's going to happen. I think the one on the hill is going to finish her off real quick. Damn it. This is brutal, man. I guess I should have expected it, though. If we go from the side, there's better chance to hit the... Oh, he's got 11 left in the torso there. On my way. We're on fire too, which really sucks, but not much we can do about it. Um, Rex generates a lot of heat, so let's drop that. Ooh, large does too. Um, let's go with the boltons. Doesn't got much left in that torso, so all we gotta do is get a torso hit here. Roger that. I think these guys are running XLs, so it's just the torso we gotta claim. You're gonna go after it. Yep. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. No, you should be saying yes, 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 yes. Copy that. Target confirmed. Ah, oh, you missed with too many. Orders. Try to keep our side to the guys down at the other end there. Okay, firing at this guy. Firing on target. Nice. One less target. All right, feeling a little better. Yes, commander. Let's get you out of the area. So we're gonna pull her back. We're gonna use her as a clinch vehicle. Once we're able to engage with these guys freely and we get them on us, I'm going to bring her back in. And either A, their missile launchers will go after her, or B, um, she'll just terrorize the shit out of them, one or the other. Aye, aye. Double time. Let's go. Let's close the distance. Trebuchet is the first victim for us at the moment not the best chance to hit um let's drop a little bit of recoil and just fire one round nothing oh crap awaiting orders that's all right man that's all right now do we have a way down over there we don't what i would give for one jump jet right about now but not worried about that at the moment. Galleon is pretty useless, but if we can just get rid of it now, that'd be nice. And we can bring the Cephalus down when those guys get a little closer. That's a lot of heat, but let's just go after them. Yeah, we need targeting computers real bad. Fuck off. That. Awaiting orders. Just try driving into a brick wall. Go into full throttle. Just try driving into something at 25 tons. 
tell me if you enjoy it. Uh, let's fire at this guy. Copy that. Get some sensors down there. Yeah. I wonder if the galleon took any damage to the front. Oh, it did. Look at that. Yeah, our AMS is like just burned out within the first couple of a crossbow, really. Ooh, he shot his own guy. Okay. Reporting. Minimal damage. These guys must have good targeting computers, because I'm at a uh, pretty damn good like amount of range here, and uh, they're getting pretty here accurate. Coordinates received. Don't shoot the cephalus. Of course. Shooting from the front, where do we hit the side? Because every time. Yes, Commander. <laughs> it's just without fail. Just without fail. Alright. <sighs> we'll take that. 64%, sure. Standing by. On my way. Okay, just park it here for now. Give up everything you got. Okay, who's going first down here? Trebuchet. It's pretty quick. These guys are all pretty quick. Holy crap. Yep, move forward. Bring it in, baby. Bring it in. I have a feeling that's the last time you're going to shoot. Oh, my armor's melting off. The whole point of you being in front, buddy. So the crossbow, I don't think, is 1,200 armor. Holy crap. I was going to say, I don't think it's that bad, because I thought these were older mechs, but I guess it's an updated version. Mm hmm Are you backing up or are you moving forward? Forward, okay. Pulse laser. I'm under heavy fire here. Yeah, we're gonna bank left and right here. This guy's in a crossfire zone, so we're gonna bank left and right so these guys at the back don't have too much of a uh, visual on us. We all are on my way. We are all getting our ass kicked, so you just hang in there, buddy. Shit, we missed all the big stuff. Oh, we can't do that. And I forgot to change it back to double shot. Damn it. Guys are all so fast too. Reporting. Major armor loss. <laughs> Commander. Hmm. Confirmed. This guy's gonna live another day. We're not not much not much chance to hit this guy either. Okay, nice. That's a big hit. A few more sensors in there. Reporting. We don't have a lot of vigilance, eh? Ten four. Firing on target. Waiting for orders. Affirmative. 
Much as I hate to do this, we've got to kill this guy because he's going to come back. Right, Commander. Oh, for fuck's sakes, you and your lasers. You and your lasers, my God. How warm is that guy? Not very warm. Right here. <sighs> Copy. Time to start coming back. We needed that trebuchet to be gone this turn, and he wasn't. <sighs> okay. Wait, they got five back there? Of course. I think there's any way to avoid those flames if we're just walking. So, I'm gonna take them. See ya. Firing all weapons. Did not mean to put the sensors down. Damn it. Tango down. Reporting. Internal damage. I wish I really wish I could turn melee off. It's just there's just suicide mechs. It's just straight up suicide is what it is. Move order confirmed. Okay. Let's hope we get the kill on this guy. Firing at enemy city. Tango down. No more charging us. So I guess the Holopolis being on its backside, they can't get a direct line of sight on it, it looks like. Losing armor. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it doesn't look like they can get a line of sight on it. Minimal damage on that hit. Hmm. Waiting for orders. I think we might be in a good position here. Yeah. Uh, wait, back to two. Here we go. Alright, we got one hit on him. Good to go. Got it. Come on, Griff. Let's give it to him then. Nice. Nice shooting. Yes, Commander. You're probably going to get one shot at this. Accelerating two locations. Probably only going to get one shot at this. What do you need? All right, buddy. Uh, looks like your whole side is messed up. Is that the left uh, side? What side is I'm it? Up. Left side. Let's go. Copy. 
Copy that. Reduce mobility. My you think? Limping. All right, ten percent on you. Six and eight. So we're gonna fire. I. Oh, there's a friggin' elemental back there. I'm gonna fire on this guy. I don't know how many, how many more chances we're gonna get to shoot. So five points. Sure. Where is that elemental? I don't see him. Somewhere back there. Standing by. Okay, it's a new turn. Hmm. Get our front facing them. Don't like the positioning, but we're going to take it. Um, and yeah. Giving them everything I've got. Nice. Okay. It's nice and toasty Alpha's now. It's good news for us. I'm using, hopefully, he'll shoot less. If not, hopefully, he'll shut his ass down. That'll be nice. If that happens. Yeah, it's just gonna drop heat. Good thing. Good thing for us. Yeah. Moving himself into the sacrificial lamb position. Not the best place to shoot from, but it is the best angle for our mech to be at, so we're gonna go there. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice indeed. We're going to take that shot. Reporting. I need Moving you to drop some heat. I need you to drop heat, please. Thank you. Man, we're running super hot in this planet. Griffin. Shadowhawk. Infiltrator's like right in here. Is he? It must be on the Shadowhawk. He's probably on the Shadowhawk. Commander? Stay on this guy's side. It's where it's the most damaged. Should have good chances to hit. We do. Firing everything. Nice. Got past the armor. Standing by. God, it can't be like that. It can be there Roger though. That. Okay, we're in strike position anyway. Orders. Location confirmed. It's only 12%, but Roger. this guy's badly damaged. Hopefully we can hit a couple. Yep. Core crit, which means it's going to be overheating every turn. Yes, Commander. Roger that. Let's go for the kill. Confirm. Target's taking a critical hit. Yeah, he's not going anywhere either. Now with that amount of heat, he isn't. Awaiting orders. I need you to use lasers on this guy. I don't want to be wasting them on the other guys. Or wasting my um, ammo on this guy. I want to be able to shoot out the other guys. So lasers only. Here it comes. Wow. Why are you shooting the spots that have already been hit or haven't been hit yet? Just shoot the areas that have been hit. I'm here.
There we go. Enemy down. There we go. I should have waited for Griff, but I want Griff to start sh shooting at one of these guys. Like this guy. Waiting for orders. Alright, you're as far that way as you can already go, huh? It's running nice and cool, too, which I like. Four rounds to the cluster left, so I guess we'll just shoot at anything over 20. Ultra and LRMs are both down. I don't know if the Ultra is jammed or if it's out of ammo. Got it. Okay, good damage. Right here. Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, he's got a rider. This fucker does. Receiving you. Move into position. Okay. Drop some lerms on this guy. Firing. Take whatever hits I can get at this moment. What are you doing? Commander. Let's get up here and brace. Okay, we're ready to fight Commander? again. Moving to position. Let's drop our heat. We don't have to rush this. Don't have to rush it at all. Just take our time, minimize our damage, get our heat back. Waiting for orders. They don't have indirect. Let's just wait a turn. Wait till we can all move on him. If we all move on him at the same time and all fire at the same time, we could pull his ass down. Not exactly sure what you're attempting to do over there. Oh, his ultra was jammed. Okay. Yes, Commander. Not quite ready. Roger that. Ready for orders. Do I let him shoot for me? I don't think so. I think if he wants to shoot for me, he's got to earn it. All right, let's get on this guy. I want him gone. I'm not going to do it from up there. It's this guy's turn to die. Uh, remotes are gone. Okay. Target locked. Okay, standing in fire, which is a good thing. Okay, Griffin's finally coming back. He does have indirect. Okay, that's interesting. He's been silent for so long. Minimal damage, Commander. Commander. Alright. Let's hope we hit with most of this. Age. Looks like the ACs hit, but I don't think the uh, the missile hit. It's fine. Receiving you.
Not quite ready to go yet. Not quite ready to dart in there yet. Once this Shadow Hawk goes down. Still pretty darn accurate, that guy. I'm showing minor damage. I know, I don't I don't consider 45 minor damage, buddy. Standing by. All right, let's hope this does the job. Actually, what is it on the other guy? 55 for a back strike. Ooh, it's juicy. Sixty-one though, but if we get a hit here, it's gonna cause major. I'm going after the back. It's gonna cause major damage if we get the hit. Oh, you missed with the you. Waiting for orders. It's frustrating. I, I needed at least one of them to hit. Uh, we use the combat shotgun or not? Do it. Okay, nice. Nothing. In, oh, no, ultra crit, but no, nothing in that arm. So, yes, commander. Didn't really lose anything. Twenty-six percent. Forty-four in the Griffin, eh? We'll take the forty-four. Awaiting orders. Wilco. We're taking the heat. I'm fine with that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm losing lots of armor. Too little. Awaiting orders. Too late. Little too little, little too late, buddy. I want this guy. Mortars, mortars are grenade launchers on this guy till he's gone, and everybody else on the other guy. Oh, you still goes on 16, eh? Okay. Sure. Come on, buddy. What are you up to? Probably gonna try and step on the vehicle. No, he's gonna back up. Going after the vehicle, though. You know the threat. You know the threat. Yeah. I want to shoot that guy from the front. On my way. Not the undamaged side. And yep. I'm on it. Still hit his side, though. Solid connection on. He's almost a stick at this point. Good to go. Come on, Griff. Let's see if we can make him a stick. Force him to bail out, buddy. How are we looking here for damage? Pretty good. Uh, I want to leave off that one, I think. It's a high percentage chance to hit. Well, maybe we leave off the mediums. Because I want to keep the heat... A little lower so we can maneuver around that uh, griffin. Critical hit, Commander. Still hanging in there. Right here. Still hanging in there. Moving to position. He's not now, though. Okay, firing at me. 
got him. You did. Good to go. Two turns of missiles Locked left. Off. Reporting. Don't get too close. The guy's got battle armor. I've yet to see what it'll do. I know they're still working on the system right now, so... I'm interested to see what the battle armor will do. I know uh, somebody mentioned that they're doing a battle armor playthrough. Um, and if you use them, if you're on a vehicle and you ride up and get off and then r attack a mech, and then use them the next turn to get back on the vehicle and ride away, they do a fair amount of damage. It's just apparently it's slow going at the start. Yes, shoot the Wolverine. By all means. He's got lots of armor. What do you need? I need you to end this guy. Moving out. Almost out of ammo. Taking the shot. Aye aye. I don't want to get too close. I'm, I'm just worried about getting too close to this guy. The battle armor hops off and murders us. Uh, yep. Firing on target. Waiting for orders. Right, commander. It's just a shoot fest now. You know, I think the one way to avoid this would be to remove battle armor and re remove melee and I think the, the battles would be so much more dynamic. Firing on target. Critical hit, Commander. You just all out of AC5 ordinance. Teed him up for this guy. Shoot, I gotta go a little farther, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can read, honestly. Yeah, it puts, puts me in the range of fire next turn. Get over here. I'm there. And of course the ultra's jammed at, the, at this moment. Critical hit, Commander. Okay, buddy. Yeah, don't bother moving. You did your job. You soaked up all the damage when we needed you to, so... Long-range missiles are out. Twenty-two heat from standing in fire. What are you going to do? That's not the threat. Indicator shows minimal damage. Awaiting orders. But I commend you for thinking that it is. Let's end this guy. Good to go. I want him gone this turn, everybody. He's given us his side, so let's take it. Let's burn through him. Tenfold. Ooh, head hit, nice. That one. Awaiting orders. He's given us his side, let's take it. Time to burn through this guy. I don't think you're surviving this one. Engaging target. Nope. Battle armor's down, no? Hostile removed. Oh. Mission successful. Um, I guess the battle armor is considered destroyed at the same time. So I'm interested to see what the code is on that battle armor once it gets perfected because, I mean, really, at that point, it probably should have hopped off of that mech the moment the Cephalus and the SM-1 closed on the Shadowhawk, that battle armor should have hopped out, hopped off and engaged for sure. But, you know, it is what it is. It's so, it's so hard to write code for that, I can imagine. I, 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 couldn't, I couldn't imagine the number of variables they got to account for, right? So, Helopolis, how badly did we get crippled here? Just the leg, which had nothing in it. Good thing I didn't have any ammo there, eh? Um, Alright. Um, 
Yeah, I think we're good everywhere else, unless, the, unless we lost the Nidhogg, but I don't know if we have or not. That'll be bad if we have. Um, okay. So, full crossbow, Axeman. So this is the 9A. The one crossbow I saw was, like, really garbage. But this one is actually wasn't that bad. Griffin, Orion. I mean, we should take three Orion parts and see how we do. This is the LBX-10 version. Wait. Oh, it's swipe with the light like Gauss rifle, rifle. Oh, I see. And this one was... Command console. Shadowhawk. Trebuchet, advanced AMS. Not bad. Bright Bloom lasers, ER medium lasers, pair of three LRM 20s, narc launchers, Thunderbolt 15, nine tons, 90 damage, though. It's pretty good. Command console's there. This isn't bad, but it's like you're basically sacrificing a mech to run it. But the, the 50 lance base sight distance to all allies, plus one initiative for all lance mates. You know, one increased resolve for all lance mates, two injuries resisted, like it's got a passive ECM and stealth bonus. Like the thing is pretty damn good. So, I mean, you just have to determine what mech is going to run it. Mostly your, uh, probably your rear liner. So there's one ton of Thunderbolt ammo left, so it's not really worth it. It's like what, four shots? Yeah, four shots. Whew, I know the command console is worth a fair bit. Uh, where is it here? No, it's not. 500,000. They used to be. What if we grab that and two Orion pieces? Let's grab the... Um, hmm... The Gauss Rifle? Maybe we just grab one piece of each. That way if we get pieces of either, then we have a chance to get, like, either one. Let's go that route. Alright, crossbow piece, griffin piece. Two, three... Okay, we know we have at least four Orion pieces. There it is. Full Orion. Any more pieces? Yep. Five, uh, six, six Orion pieces. SRM-4, heavy jump jets, basic sensors can go. Keep the ammo for sure. Well, there you go. We got lucky on that roll, man. We could, that could have been so much worse. Now it's just deciding which one of these versions I want to put together. The light Gauss rifle version. Two ballistic, two laser, two missile. Or... The command version with three laser, one ballistic, and two missile. I'm interested to know where the hard points are on this. If it's one ballistic in each arm, this guy could turn into our rack five beast again. I don't know if you I don't know if you guys saw the series I did quite a while back with Rogue Tech. We had an Orion with a or rack five in each arm. And I think it was the command I think it was the command console version. I think we I thought we had a command console in it, but it was like a pair of Rack 5s, and that thing was brutal. That was one that the Rack 5s just did 45 damage each. Just flat out. There was no heavy and, and, and regular. There was just the the the, reg, the, the uh, Rack 5. So that was basically the equivalent of a pair of heavy Rack 5s. That thing was just, it just shreds stuff. We might be able to get that going again. Wow, 304,000. Well, we made a million, so I mean... <laughs> It's not like I'm worried about paying that out. I think we should, we have enough for our financial report now too, which is good. But we got another notification in three days. And we're not going to have everybody back by then. Holopolis is down for 25. Yeah, we can't have all our mechs back for then either. So we're going to have to skip. I don't know. We may have to skip the next two because the Talos won't be back for eight. You almost have to have a couple of full functioning lances if you're going to pull these contracts off, you know? But anyway, 
I'm going to end this episode here, guys. Um, I'm just going to get the stuff repaired. I may have to skip over one contract, and then when we come back, uh, we'll probably take another one. See how it goes then. The Holopolis definitely won't be back for the fight, which is unfortunate, but it's, it is what it is. And then we'll, we'll take the... Uh, We'll take the Jenner out, and hopefully we don't get brutalized this bad. If it's really bad, I mean, we may have to pull out, but we'll see how it goes. But I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.